you have power over your mind, not outside events. Realize this, and you will find strength. Dwell on the beauty of life. Watch the stars, and see yourself, running with them. The happiness of your life, depends upon, the quality of your thoughts. Everything we hear, is an opinion, not a fact. Everything we see, is a perspective, not the truth. Waste no more time, arguing about, what a good man should be. Be one. If you are distressed, by anything external, the pain, is not due to the thing itself, but to your estimate of it, and this, you have the power to revoke, at any moment. When you arise in the morning, think of what a privilege it is, to be alive, to think, to enjoy, to love. The best revenge, is to be unlike him, who performed the injury. The soul becomes dyed, with the color of its thoughts. Accept the things, to which fate binds you, and love the people, with whom fate brings you together, but do so, with all your heart. It is not death, that a man should fear, but he should fear, never beginning to live. Never let the future disturb you. You will meet it, if you have to, with the same weapons of reason, which today arm you, against the present. Our life, is what our thoughts make it. If someone is able to show me, that what I think or do is not right, I will happily change, for I seek the truth, by which no one, was ever truly harmed. It is the person, who continues in his self-deception and ignorance, who is harmed. Whenever you are about to find fault with someone, ask yourself the following question, what fault of mine, most nearly resembles, the one I am about to criticize? I have often wondered, how it is that, every man loves himself more, than all the rest of men, but yet, sets less value on his own opinion of himself, than on the opinion of others. The object of life, is not to be on the side of the majority, but to escape finding oneself, in the ranks of the insane. If it is not right, do not do it. If it is not true, do not say it. Very little is needed, to make a happy life. It is all within yourself, in your way of thinking. The best revenge, is not to be like your enemy. Reject your sense of injury, and the injury itself disappears. When another blames you or hates you, or people voice similar criticisms, go to their souls, penetrate inside, and see what sort of people they are. You will realize, that there is no need to be racked with anxiety, that they should hold any particular opinion about you. How much more grievous are the consequences of anger, than the causes of it? The first rule, is to keep an untroubled spirit. The second, is to look things in the face, and know them for what they are. Do not act, as if you were going to live, 10,000 years. Death hangs over you. While you live, while it is in your power, be good. Look well into thyself. There is a source of strength, which will always spring up, if thou wilt always look. How much time he gains, who does not look to see, 
what his neighbor says or does or thinks, but only at what he does himself, to make it just and holy. Do every act of your life, as though it were, the very last act of your life. Perfection of character is this, to live each day, as if it were your last, without frenzy, without apathy, without pretense. Look back over the past, with its changing empires, that rose and fell, and you can foresee the future too. For it is in your power, to retire into yourself, whenever you choose. The impediment to action, advances action. What stands in the way, becomes the way. Never esteem anything, as of advantage to you, that will make you break your word, or lose your self-respect. Receive without conceit, release without struggle. Your days are numbered. Use them to throw open the windows of your soul to the sun. If you do not, the sun will soon set, and you with it. How ridiculous and how strange to be surprised at anything which happens in life. If any man despises me, that is his problem. My only concern is not doing or saying anything deserving of contempt. Humans have come into being for the sake of each other, so either teach them or learn to bear them. Do what you will. Even if you tear yourself apart, most people will continue doing the same things. <laughs>